Uh, hello. It's, hello. It's D and D time. Oh, hello. hello. Howdy. <sighs> so, um, you guys are in Fort Gaulian on the foresty island, dominated by a big tree named Kale, friendly fella, likes to chat. Yep, he does like to chat. Um, last time, everyone was here. Pat yourselves on the back. There you go, there you go. Yes. Uh, we had a wild elf and spider fight. Um, <laughs> and then after the fight, you found Buren the Druid, who, um, narrowly survived. One more death, one more death save by David's d20s. He'd been dead. But he made it. <laughs> you found him. Uh, you also found a forester named Wayne. I think that was his name. Wayne. He's a very, he's a very important character. Um, <laughs> you, uh, um, Eru was being um, a bully and stealing things out of Buren's pocket. I didn't and, trust that guy. And found wow. that he was he uses okay. a spell book, unlike a druid <clears throat> that he claims to be. Um, and um, you found out Buren's so he's been like tracking this uh, this flower, um, which I learned today. I didn't learn before. So Belladonna is also the uh, nightshade, deadly nightshade. Same thing. Yeah. I didn't know that. And I do now. You I, know. I do now. I don't remember any. I guess I guess maybe the deadly nightshade has those little the little flowers, the little purple flowers. Yeah, that's what they are. Like that little like purple. Yeah, but like um. Yeah, I guess I've never seen one. I've seen nightshades. I guess I've never seen that one. I only know it from the Nightmare Before Christmas. Let me look it up Christmas. and see if I'm just totally not thinking about the right thing. Is it in the Nightmare Before Christmas? Yeah, it's the what um, the the girl, the creation girl, mm -hmm. puts in the doctor's soup to make him pass out. Oh. Did she call it <coughs> Deadly, Deadly Nightshade? Something Nightshade. I think it's Deadly, but it's been a while since I've seen that. She puts frog's yeah. breath over it to cover the to cover the taste. Belladonna. <laughs> There it is. A trope of Eladonna, also known as Deadly Nightshade. Whoa. Yeah, now I know, uh, I think that was Joe that made that. Made, are you the one that made that god? Uh, yeah. Because I think, yeah, because Atropa is the is the, also the name of the god. And the flower is the symbol that went with it. Very, very clever. Very clever. <laughs> very clever. Where? <laughs> um, <laughs> Someone did some research. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a little berry on it. Yeah, yeah, like a little blackberry. Yeah. Um, so, uh, oh, you found out that, so, so Buren has been finding these flowers, and that flower is the symbol of Atropa, who is the, the god of death. Not a good sign, says Buren. And, um, he thinks that there is something infecting the woods, and, and also leading the elves and the, um, the spiders. Um, and also you learn that the elves are not too highly looked upon uh, around town. Um, and the kale, the big tree, he wants you to kick everyone out of town, make everyone leave because yeah. he needs the island. And that's what he told you two times ago. But then this time, Buren says that can't happen because if that happens, then whatever is infecting is going to take over. So you, you grabbed yourself a couple of elf heads <laughs> and you strolled into town. <laughs> like no, you do. <laughs> <laughs> Looking to, um, speak with the dead, but that didn't quite go... Didn't quite go how you wanted, because I'm not sure it was completely thought through. <clears throat> well, we still have them. But you went for it anyway, and you still got some marauding <laughs> elven heads on your belt. <clears throat> so you are in the town of Fort Gaulian. You've got five days until Ulf friends or family show up. Someone related to Ulf. Um, you've got, I think, about five days until your, your cloak is ready to go. Yep. I guess you're four days now because it's the morning of the next day. You get your full rest. Nice. How how did my poison harvesting go? Um, I uh, may or may not have forgotten to to, to look that up. <laughs> <laughs> Here's your chance. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> you, you want so you wanted to make? Um, Ask ChatGPT. <laughs> yeah. What? Give me. What, would you, what exactly did you want? Make potions. <clears throat> it's not not potions. <laughs> Poisons, <laughs> uh, like a like a like the poison. His stuff. knives. You so got, mechanically, you... the way I thought it would work is I would get you know however many vials I can squeeze out of this gland, mm -hmm. and then use like a bonus action to coat 
a dagger in it, and then it would do whatever it does, whatever the poison is. <clears throat> um, poisons are kind of lame in 5e. That's what I was going to look up. I was going to try to find something better for you, because I know there's, like, other books out there that cover this better. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we'll just... I think they're as good as they are in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Yeah, the five E basic rules for poisoner poison yeah, is, is ridiculous. Like the cost of it, and you get yeah. one stick with it. It's kind of yeah. dumb. All the alchemist stuff in the original book is not very great. Um, I mean, I'm fine with just like how how many however many vials you say I get out of this thing, and then I would use one vial per application. Let's do this. What's your um ability check? So you have so what's your dex plus ability plus what's your dex with? Proficiency. Modifier. Dex with proficiency would be plus seven. Dex with expertise would be plus eleven. Are you ex expertise is what you put for poisons? That's what I have in sleight of hand. I'm not technically proficient in the poisoner's thing, though. Um, The poisoner's kit. Oh, yeah, proficient with the poisoner's kit. I'm proficient with alchemist supplies. Um, I might be able to make poison with that. I'll tell you what. Leave it to Explain. fate. Roll a d20. Whatever number you get above 10 with your dex plus proficiency is how many vials you get. Dex plus proficiency. So okay. it's, it's possible to fail, you don't get any. It's also possible to have 27 or 17. Okay, so get this is plus... This. You're about to have 17 vials, boys. <laughs> plus 7. <laughs> okay, here we go. <clears throat> oh, you want, which map are you on? Oh, 23! Well, I, I didn't see it, doesn't count. Oh. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not on that map. You got a 23? Yeah. Okay. So, 13 vials of poison? 13 vials of poison. 13. <laughs> That's a good point. If you're not proficient in poison making, can't you poison yourself by accident? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I'm, I mean, it depends on how you... Because this is... I'm thinking this is an, uh, an injury poison. Which means that, like, getting it on my skin wouldn't necessarily hurt. It has to be Isaac stuttering oh, on, means man. yes. Y yeah. <laughs> well, because like in the DMG, there's you got there's, any cracks in your in your fingers or anything from doing. There's oh yeah, you see what you did is you got a cut on your finger, then you, then then you stuck your hand in the in the uh, jalapeno bin at Pizza Hut. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, oh yeah, it's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's the worst. Find so many paper cuts that way. It's the worst. Yeah. That's how the poison gets in, dude. You don't, <laughs> yeah, even, it is. you don't even think about it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I've done it. I've done it myself. It sucks. You get some this like is, acetone um... on your hand, and you've got like a cut, and you're like, ah! <laughs> you might like, just, you need to be proficient way. with poison making, otherwise you might need to decide to make sure it's real by taste testing by it. By tasting it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's how you test that's how you test potions in D D. Any random potion you give it like the, the one finger yeah. lick and like, it's ah, what it is. This is a potion huh? of giant strength. <laughs> ah, this is a poison. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you're What's, good. Just uh, one finger full, you live. <laughs> this is a spider poison. What's the the stats for it? Uh, is there a generic stat for 5e? There's like a bunch of different poisons for five. Like you can get if you theoretically there's there's one for purple worm. Like if you harvest it from a purple worm, you get what the purple worm does in its stat block. Dang, that seems real strong. Yeah, you so. imagine you come <laughs> your dad and you go, bam, just wreck something. Okay, well, I mean, it, we'll just use we'll use the spider stat. You're already okay, so OP. What's the what's the, what's the, the harm in going save? over? <laughs> <laughs> Is oh, it a con save? Yeah, it's a con save. Let me pull it up here. We're pretty average. Well, you are. <laughs> yeah. But the rogue. <laughs> <laughs> I can do a lot of damage sometimes. <laughs> uh, so it's a con 11. Con 11. Yeah, 2d8 poison. And half. Right. And if you reduce them to zero hit points, it's just a giant spider stat. If you reduce them to zero points with that blow... They go unconscious. They're paralyzed. And they don't die. What? So you're gonna be leaving a lot of like just unconscious folks. That's rough. On path. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the worst death. I'll just stab him again. It's all right. <laughs> Jeez. That's how I make bad guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, I close my thing. Where are we? So you are in Fort Gallian. Um, you've got. Uh, six days until um, Kale wants you out. 
You've got four days until Ulf's friends will be here. Um, I can hear myself and it's distracting. Oh, Francisco. <laughs> My bad. Um, you've got there you go. four days until your cloak is ready, I think. Yeah. I'm not keeping track of that. I think it's four days. Um, and I mean, you can do your cloak now. You just will take, will, will suffer the consequences. Okay. It was great this last time. So, I mean, like, if we just want to ball out of here, we can. <laughs> Uh, I want I'm, to. I'm all right. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, let's be sure next time. The car <laughs> the carnival has left a day ago with some kids, you think. Um, they are, you think, going to Moldrova, wherever that, that place is? Moldrosa? Wherever. That's what they said, but we don't buy it. But you don't buy it. Um, <laughs> and... Um, Vloon loss is coming. Yeah, balloon loss. Yeah, he <laughs> ate all the fish. What do you want uh, to do? It so is the got... morning of the day. Got a long rest? Yes. Normally you need to sleep a little longer for that, but it's fine. It's You got cozy bed, no watch. Um, you guys are in comfy spot here. Just the impending doom of a god slowly taking over the town while we sleep, you know? Mm, so restful. So restful and relaxing. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the life. <clears throat> this is the life. Wow. How beautiful is this place? Totally worth the, the total collapse of society on this part of the planet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll get up and I guess let's go find Bjorn, eh? Yeah. Wait, where'd he say no. he would be? What if we talk to the tree about his sickness thing? What would happen? What be? What do you mean? Like we need if we talk to the tree about saying his he's sick. I, I don't think he's sick. I think growing. he's. Well, according to Buren, there's a sickness growing on him. I don't, I don't know. know he seems all right to me. I think that Buren maybe thinks he's corrupted. I think maybe he's just, like, wanting the <laughs> land back so that he can... If this thing is attacking him, and we don't know that, it could just be that he's, like, powering up for the fight. Well, Buren seems to think that if the people leave, it will ultimately kill Kale. Well, what does he know? He hasn't actually well, talked to him. Well, that's why we're going to look. Hmm. Anyways, where did he say he would be? <laughs> I don't know. He didn't say, you saw him walking. Hut. You saw him walking out of town. So you assume he's going back to his hut that is overgrown. I'm about to say the hut was like totally overgrown, right? It, I mean, it, he could crawl and into it. He could crawl into his little hut, but yeah, it's it's not very livable. Man, I wouldn't have gone back out there. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't want to go out there either. You're a real druid. <laughs> I've told you this. I'm not a plants guy. <laughs> I mean, you seem like you were you were pretty planty the other day. So I mean, it was just I saw point. I saw what those trees were doing. That that seemed pretty on point. For well, point that was just man. a new thing. I, I... <laughs> and you're Maybe talking to the tree. You know, I mean, I, this has been a wonderful experience. Maybe I'm gonna convert. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be the time for it. Yeah, you seem to do better with the plants than the stars. I mean, technically, <laughs> that could be your plant god, right? Is that how it works? I, I don't know. You talk to him. <laughs> he just seemed like a well, like maybe an above-average intelligence tree. How many trees <laughs> have you talked to? <clears throat> a handful. Really. You just cast a spell and everything kind of talks. <laughs> most, trees are, are, most trees are kind of angry, but they're, you know, all bark, no bite. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this guy, zing. he knows what's going on. That's just a walker by. He just walked by and said that. <laughs> we talk awfully loud. I think everybody's going to think we're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Who was that guy? <laughs> talking about talking to trees and stuff. You should have heard all the grass. It was going crazy. <laughs> that was so funny. Oh, man. Okay, let's go find Buren. Let's get out of this inn. 
I'm people are listening you. to us walking by and making snide they remarks on our conversations. Up in He's so, be uh, as we're walking, <laughs> so, uh, was it like every blade of grass talked or just like clubs? Uh, I, it was just so loud and <laughs> they were so all screaming. So probably every probably blade. each blade. I'm going to go with each blade. <laughs> Oof. Like a little Hurt tiny mouth on the blade just opening, yelling at you. That's a lot. Okay, in the morning sun, you make your way out of town, and you head Did down the path. Hungry? There is no no path anymore. You just sort of remember where the path was. As soon as you step outside, before you had the kind of that, we had that road that led down the way towards where Kale is, and it is all overgrown. Um, you basically just open, it's like when you open the door in a big snowstorm, you know, and you got just a big wall of trees. Or, I, I mix my, my metaphor there. You know when you see those <laughs> things online, they open the door, and they're just like a big wall of snow. What do you mean online? I lived that. Okay. <laughs> well, you remember when those I of us, those of us from Oklahoma, there was a big wall just... of snow. <laughs> <laughs> open the door and there's just snow. Open the gates, trees and plants, not trees, but plants and vines and bushes. <laughs> trees. <laughs> trees. <laughs> Drunk. That was that was real fast. <laughs> and you, it's it's not like, it's three feet th uh, deep right now, or or thereabouts. Just this. It's just this vine and, and um, like, trudging through a, a forest, you know, but just the yeah. undergrowth. And, but you know where Buren is, so you can make your way there. It just takes a bit, you know, getting a, a trudging your way over there. Yeah. Um, and you can, the first thing you notice is you hear muttering on the wind, is you hear the sound of Buren, who's not happy about something. And you get closer, and you can see him, and he's, he's, he's like, trying to, he's, he's not trying to, like, harm the vines and things, but he's trying to push them out of the way so he can get his pot back. And he's pushing it. He's still at his house, but he's very disturbed about how everything is just overgrown and just, like, completely swarmed his whole place. And he sees you how coming. be disturbed? And he, and he, oh, help. welcome back. Are you ready to go? And he's pushing things and trying to get his cauldron set up. I don't, I, I would just not bother with the cauldron and all that. <laughs> he, how, what am I supposed to eat? I've had this uh, stew going for five years. <laughs> <laughs> the unlimited stew. I think it's time to start a new stew. It's just all like all kinds of gross all stuff in the bottom of that pot. Nah, <laughs> nah. They do. They actually do that in some places. That's real. The forever soup. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll still take my my serving off the top, please. <laughs> <laughs> the bottom's Don't where all the good mine. stuff is. <clears throat> all right. Yeah, we are ready. Where are we yep. going? Well, I'm, I'm, I got us. He grabs his mat. He gets his. He got his bag. His messenger like bag thing that straps over the side in the edge of his yep. bag. And he digs in there and he grabs that map and he hands it over and he says and he and he points. And there's just sort of a general vicinity of like a. You figure probably about a. 10, 20 mile radius just in the west eastern corner of the island and he says, he taps on it somewhere over there, I'm sure we'll find something you guys are tough you don't sound uh, oh, wait, 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 uh, get, me the, get me there and then, and then, we'll, and then we'll, we'll I'm sure we'll, <sighs> something will stand out alright, well, if we're gonna go let's get a move on let's get, let's get started has anything changed in his demeanor today? Um, I mean, he's let's see, he has kind of a grumpy demeanor. Okay, just trying to. If suddenly he's trying to lead us into a trap or something, give me an in insight check. Krog has a grumpy demeanor too. <laughs> <laughs> Krog always has a grumpy demeanor, but not yeah. like you. <laughs> Twenty-four. It's all that IBS. <laughs> I would be grumpy too. <laughs> yeah, Zuri just, just wants to get trying, out of here. Trying to <laughs> do it. Fix my spam. <clears throat> okay, there it is. Um. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. I'm staring him down, I'm up and down. <laughs> what'd you what'd you get? Twenty four. Twenty four. Okay, yeah. He he seems ready to go. Okay. Um, 
I don't know how to close this window now. I'm so confused. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm gonna have, I have moderators for this kind of thing, and I don't know how to handle this. <laughs> That's my Trying to ban that guy that was yeah. doing the. the yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, that so. Made, um, what was he doing? I'm just trying to sell followers. Ads, yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. Um, okay, so you, um, yeah, so he, he, fe you, he is grumpy, um, and he <laughs> is, he's ready, he's ready to go. He, you feel like he is looking forward to this because he's got strong company with him. Okay, let's go. Okay, give me a, um, there is no path here, but give me a survival and a perception uh, and anything else you want to do to try to assist this. If you want to try to give me some sort of a map read, that's probably, that can be your survival check um, to try to figure out what he is... Um, um, where I he's pointing will, uh, at. take the map and lead the way and use my wayfinder. <laughs> yeah, once you get a certain level, you start getting spam sendings. <laughs> uh -oh. I need a good roll out of this. What what, Ooh, what, four, what page are you guys on? Let me summon you over here. We're on the main up. page. Let me summon you over like here. Like the map. I can't see what you're rolling here. What did everyone get? In D&D uh, &D Beyond, I rolled a natural 20. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we'll just take that. I, I, rolled <laughs> a, I rolled a 17 <clears throat> on survival. Okay. Um, With with that 17, you can kind of get... You can kind of figure out what he's what he's doing here. It's hard to... to get, there's not really any landmarks. It's just forced. Um... But you can see he has found some land mounts, landmarks in like a hill or like a certain shaped tree that sort of just stands out. And you can kind of gather what he has, what's it going on in his mind along with this. Um, what'd you get on perception check? Who rolled that? Uh, I'll do that. Can I assist? You can roll a perception check. I got an 18. Yeah. I rolled just... a nat 20 in, in D&D &D Beyond. <laughs> Dang, dude. D&D &D Beyond handing them out today. I got a 17. Out. No pluses? No, uh, uh, plus two. So, 19. 19? Okay. Um, little Sunny Cheeks doesn't quite hear this, but Zarek, with a keen ear, you're, uh, you're kind of trudging through this forest, and just a quick uh, um, voice on the wind. And you... You can't make out what it said, or what it, you can you can't even tell like what, what um, language or anything. You just got there's something um, humanoid. Is can up I ahead. tell where it was? Where it came? Oh, up from up ahead. Yeah. Okay, I'll point that out to the party. You got a sort of a ahead and and to the to the west to the right. How far? He doesn't know. He just, there was a, he just got just a quick piece of a word. Quick piece of a word. <clears throat> uh, you want to check it out? To... Sure. <laughs> I'm going to hide and try to move up ahead of the group in, in that direction and see if I can. Okay. Give me that stealth check. Booyah. <laughs> Lucky better when you were an OP. <laughs> so you you guys You uh, gave me that cloak. <laughs> <laughs> you see the the rogue take a step and you're like, is that what he's gonna do? And then all of a sudden he just disappears. <laughs> as he starts making his way through the woods. <laughs> and you're walking in give you give me a perception check as well as you're trying now that he kinda has guided you in a direction. Let's see if you can pick this up. Sixteen. You don't, you're not picking anything up as far as like where to walk, um, but you're Dang. you're squeezing your way through this forest and um, you're going kind of straight. But then as you get to a point and you look over and you can see there is a ruin, uh, like at one time it was a tower of some kind, stone building. It's completely overgrown. It's all green, and you can see there's movement on that ruin. You can't tell what it is. Perception wasn't very good, but you picked up something on top of it walking around. 
It okay, walked. It walked out and then walked <clears throat> back behind, like a overgrown, like a tree overgrowing. Is uh, my party within 120 feet of me? Um. Yeah. Okay. I will send a message back to uh, Saren. Do you, you say that out loud? It's, I, we talked about this before. Is sending out loud. I think that well, sending is different than message. I oh, know. I, I think that you. I think that I. I think that I whisper it. I think both of both of them are whispered, right? I think so. That yeah. Was, that will be coming. In, in the other concluded. game, I, yeah. In the other game, I ruled that a sorcerer can do it without, without if he uses subtle spell. I'll buy you a subtle spell. <clears throat> okay. Uh, you still good yeah, enough so though. I will, so yeah, it'll whisper very quietly. So you do not need to roll a stealth check because you are a master stealth. Then the other ones, though, if <laughs> you want to reply, you're gonna have to stealth. Yeah, I'll do a stealth. If I'm talking, do I get disadvantage because of my armor? No. Okay. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you have to get a deep breath to whisper. He's real so animated. Like, <laughs> yeah, you gotta wave your arms around. Natural around. 19. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What do you want to say? I... Did you reply uh, yet, Joe? What What I just told you was there's movement, there's a ruin over here. I can't see what it is. Is it safe to move up? I will cast message again. <laughs> I will say. Just keep doing this. I don't think that they know about us yet, but I'm not sure. Um, Eru, this is far enough to the west that you think your party could easily continue on the way they were going and not have to worry about this. Okay. I think that you could probably just keep going. <laughs> but if you want to inspect it, we can. There's something here. Well, if it's the first clue to something, we'll hit us there. Send a message and say, make, ask Buren if it matches anything on his map. Hey, Bjorn, we got some runes up here. He pulls out the map and he's like, oh, yeah. And he points. He's got them marked. It's just a little X, but he's got them on the map. Where do we go from here? Well, it's a little off the... Uh, a little off the way. We're not going that way, but... I'll follow you. Well, like, do you just want to go straight there? Or are you okay with a detour? Or, like... How long do you think it is, it's going to take for him to message me again after I talk to Beer? Because yeah, I can't. Are you guys coming or not? <laughs> <laughs> um, why don't you head back for now and we can discuss it? Okay. What? I remember when I started to head back. You're showing on the map, and you can kind of oh, see right well behind you. Hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, whoa, whoa! <laughs> ah. Mm, mm. So shock the life out of me. <laughs> no, wait. I need to roll a perception. We know he's headed back, right? <clears throat> it's if Saren tells you. Dang, not good enough. <laughs> I want to try. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you don't see him. <laughs> so Biren saying, yeah, he tells about this ruin. It's, uh, <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, I've never been to the ruin. I've just kind of seen the thing, and, and uh, there's rumors of this being some like old, ancient, like empire or something. Um, I kind of want to check it out. That sounds like the perfect some side quest. Called the, <laughs> I don't know what they're called. The Fae, the Fae, something lived here. How much longer is it to the place we were supposed to be going? I mean, we don't know exactly where we're going, but but. So it could be here. Well, no, it's, it's another hour or two. Oh, okay. Well, we got plenty of time to check this out then. No, we've only got six days. Well, this is only going to take. It's only going to take I, another hour. I, I didn't say I said. I didn't say no. I just said, <laughs> like, we can't be, you know, stopping at every ruin along the way. Uh, well, this is the first one, and you got to do the first one. Yeah, I think it's like in the handbook, Adventurer's Let's... Handbook. Let's go do the first. What do you think, Aaron? Sure. You think we got the time? I don't know what we are looking for, so we could have no time or infinite time. Well, we don't have infinite time. We have six days. <laughs> Zarek, Grog, what do you think? Aaron looks at do? you and nods. 
<laughs> Krog just shrugs. You see, Zurich really wants off this island. You can clearly see that on his face. <clears throat> Maybe they... <laughs> Look over at Zurich. <laughs> so... <laughs> Really maybe guy, they know guy. something about what we are looking for. Or maybe they're going to try to kill us. But either way, it'll be fun. Your idea of fun is different than mine. Yeah, yeah, look. yeah it's a little <laughs> bit different. Um. Buren, Buren <laughs> takes that comment in and then looks at the, the heads dangling from Saren's belt and nods and says... Or no, it was on Krog's, Krog's belt. belt, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that, that makes sense. Crap. <laughs> yeah. Well, we don't attack people for no reason. They have to attack us, but it's always a pleasure. <laughs> All right, I need, if you're going to move towards the tower, I need stealth checks. Assuming you're <clears> moving <throat> stealthily, unless stealth. you want to just go charge in there. No. <laughs> don't, I'm right, sorry, no. I'm, I didn't want to <laughs> assume anything. <laughs> <laughs> didn't want to no. assume. <laughs> 24 for me. 26. Oh, no. oh sorry, I moved. Do we want, do we want pass without Ooh. a trace? Uh, yeah, really bad. <laughs> <laughs> Little post check. <laughs> Pass without trace. I'll I'll see his nice. check. What was what was your check? A five. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, I mean, you're not... He begins moving. If I start to cast and I hear a clunk, clunk, clank, clank, <laughs> I'm going to be like... Yeah. So well, you, I guess I didn't you haven't gone far enough, and with a five, you know, he's like... He's not going to go anywhere stealthy. Yeah, do I got a nineteen? Do I see any ex any movement headed towards us after I hear a clank? <laughs> you do look not back at Saren. Look over at the other ones. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking over and you're like, you I'm know, you know it. what I do, <laughs> and it's not this. Let's do you forest. know, if Aru gave you a piggyback. <laughs> they could both be stealthy. I would just fall over. <laughs> Yeah, he's and a, it would make a, a big noise. If we could find enlarge reduce. <laughs> <laughs> um. Uh, let me a uh, DM question: How long does a application of poison from a vial last after I've put it after I've applied it? It just it. We'll say it works until you use it, or until um. For a day, combat, a twenty-four like, hour period, or whatever. Okay, well, in that case, before I head over there, I will apply one thing of poison on. Well, I did... you need to get I'll one just of those, do it on. Like, I'll just do it on one dagger. Vile I was thinking about loaded preparing a couple, but yeah, I'm gonna start working on that. Yeah. <laughs> but, you can, like, but pop it in, then. and it shoots it into the blade, and then when you're done, you hit a button, and it ping shoots the little <laughs> vial out, so you can lock another <laughs> one in. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like a shotgun. <laughs> you stab enough people and you're like, and it, pew, shoots the little vial out. That'd be great. <laughs> you're just going, walking through the forest. Where are all these little vials laying around? <laughs> I've been, been stabbing all day. Just finding like dead goblins everywhere. Like, what is happening? <laughs> uh, are you are you walking up as a group? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I, uh, I am off to the side. Oh, yeah. What, what's everyone's rolls? Five. <clears throat> 26. I got 19. Well, did you do oh. pass without trace? Dang. Uh, not without. Uh, no, I did, it, it didn't matter. You you didn't do it? No, I didn't do it because it didn't matter. It makes like, rolled so low. Oh. Well, that's what we discussed a minute ago. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he said he was starting to cast it and then heard ka clank and was like, uh, I'm going to pass on that. Eh, never mind. <laughs> There's Buren with a big pack. Do you guys get someone over here? Uh, yeah, all the so. trees. 61. Yeah, lots of trees. Hut. Okay, so as you get... Um, you guys up a little bit further here. Oh, I love the mass select thing. My favorite feature. Was oh, mine mini? Yeah, we're just, oh. This is a really nice ruin. Look, it's oh. like a full complete tower. I had to de oh, deconstruct I quietly. A, had to deconstruct a little bit. Um, as you get, so you're you're about 150 feet, 160 somewhere in there. Um, you hear the sound, the distinct sound on the wind of those elf voices. Um, I got someone knows that you are 
Did I, did I miss you? Oh, whoops. Um, you have been heard, you gather. You don't, you don't speak it, but you have been heard. And up ahead, you can see just through the trees, right about the time that happens, you can see the, um, what Eru saw before in the ruin. Completely overgrown. Um, just a big hunk of rock out in the middle of the forest. There was a, a quick alarm of something in, in an elven dialect, and then silence. An elvish? Not elvish. A weird elvish that we can't understand. <clears throat> uh, I will continue to move up stealthily. Yep. Okay. Um, let's do... Uh, let's go ahead and do a turn-based, like, initiative mode. Okay. okay. So give me, I'm gonna give me your, give me your numbers. Initiative. Is that row initiative? Yeah. I want you to go over. Eight <laughs> for Zarek. My initiative is always terrible. Mine usually ten. is, too. I got ten. Fifteen. Not bad. Eight. Um, Krog, I'm gonna let you go before Zarek since you got kind of hosed in that last battle. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, David. Oh. You were a 10? I just Eric? always get special permission. Huh? You, 10, you, yeah. You got 10. So, What'd uh, you get, um. <laughs> Joe? Four. Four. Four, and then four. Isaac. 15. Where are you at? Where's your figure at? Uh oh. Over here. Where's mine? Uh oh. This forest is too dense. <laughs> is this all <laughs> difficult terrain again? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, we're going to be at the ruins in about five turns. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Walking walking stealthily through, through difficult terrain. Quarter movement speed. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah, I can only walk like 25 feet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the one who rolled a five on their stealth. You could have been closer. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, Arrow, you're up first. You do not see anything. Um, you don't. You don't see any movement. You just heard the 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 alarm and then nothing. <clears throat> how how does stealth work if I dash? Is it still just half? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I will bonus action dash, which because I'm mobile means full, but half because I'm stealth, so that's four, 45 feet. That's like a math test. Direction. Yeah, I know. Uh, do I have any new information once I get here? Uh, n no. Okay, so then I will use my action to dash and get another 20 feet. Nothing new unless you want to roll. There's nothing new just immediately, but if you want to roll perception, you can do that. All right, well, we'll just stay stealth. And we'll do the same rules I had a long time ago, but we haven't done, been doing much of it, is if you want to use a skill in combat, an action for a normal one and a bonus action for a disadvantage one. Okay. Sunny Cheeks. for me. I'm going to turn into a bird. Are you stealth, Isaac? Yeah. Okay. What was your stealth? Well, because I didn't, because I moved half speed the whole time, so I thought I'd oh, taken yeah. my previous stealth. Do you want me to roll again? Yeah. What was your, what was it? Come here. Go ahead and do it again. Just to. It was 24 this. before. Boom. So at least 24 this time. It is 24. <laughs> Okay, uh, Eric. So I need you to turn into a bird. Bird! Whatever common bird is around here. Where am I at? Always a mocking Always a mocking Jay. <laughs> or a giant eagle. <laughs> yeah, giant. <laughs> I'm not going for the giant eagle this time. <laughs> I don't even know where I am on this map. Uh, click your, um, over click your face. Over here. Yeah, I'm doing that, but it's not taking me over there. There we go. Um, let me check out my people in here, right? 
Oh, there we go. Yeah, because since we're game masters, it like doesn't always give us our. Yeah, you have to click piece. on them sometimes. Mm. All right, I'm gonna turn into a bird and I'm gonna fly, 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 fly. Uh, 120 feet this round. Put in my um. Hang on, I didn't put my monster in here. Not that there's a monster in here. Look at me majestically flying through the trees. <laughs> majestically? Yeah, I mean, look at me floating right there. What floating time of day is it? And sliding through the air. It's about about <laughs> noon. <laughs> it's high. It's high noon. noon. Where is this? Not the oh, I won't say it. I'll search it. Yeah, that guy right there. Where is he? There he is. Uh-oh. That's some sports Touchdown. news. Probably another running back. Keenan Allen to the Bears. Wait, really? Yep. Wow, they got no receivers left. What are they doing? Well, how'd they get rid of Mike Williams? <laughs> I know he had the ACL thing, but man. Okay, Krog, you're up. You done sunny cheeks? Okay. Oh, wait. You are a... Uh, what, what kind of bird are you? Like a walking bird? Yeah, like a normal okay. bird. What's the perception? What's the what's your passive perception as a mockingbird? I will it's look it up. normal. He's a druid. Wait, he mine, keeps his yeah. passive. Oh, okay. I thought you took the greater, the better of the two. I guess Dude, you could yeah. take the better, but I don't think that a mockingjay is probably better yeah. than his. Unless he gets advantage or something. I don't know. Oh. <sighs> actually hard to find uh, you done uh, in a minute. francisco uh I, I don't know where we're at on the board oh, how'd you get over there or at least <laughs> you like flew well, around no, no. <laughs> i wasn't sure where we're like supposed to be originally um right yeah there? yeah that's yeah right around there that works. right there okay yeah. i just wanted to make sure okay um bird tiny there i'll move up this way. Were we all heading this way? Or yeah, towards, towards to the, the ruins. To the ruins. Okay, so then I'll no. move. My so if you're stealthing, way then you have quarter movement. Oof, that's rough. <laughs> <laughs> but you can dash to get half movement. <laughs> so if, if half is already, because half of what forty five would be what twenty? Fifteen, wouldn't it? Uh, and a quarter of that would be what? Ten. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> you don't have to keep on stealthing if you don't want to. Yeah, you can just No, run. I do, I do. No, 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 no. I want to stealth. Uh I'll just I'll move up I there. Don't like the consequences. I just, <laughs> just don't yeah. like it. <laughs> I'll just I'll, I'll just go up to there. That's okay. it. Sarik, you're up. This is another combat. Princess, he's not gonna show up next week. I mean, all I do is just walk ten feet, and then the monster's dead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, too much. I'm sorry, too Bob. much difficult terrain. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Done. That's what I can do. Okay. Um, Actually, no. No, I'm gonna dash for another ten feet. Wait, there ten you feet go. is. If you're regular thirty. And you dash, then you get 15. Plus another 5. Total. No, 15 total. 15 total. Are you stealthing? From where you started. Oh. Are you stealthing? Yeah. Yeah. Is anyone not stealthing okay. anymore? Minus 5. Me. <laughs> I got a 5. <laughs> um, are you Ding! You're not stealthing <laughs> anymore, are you, Eric? <laughs> no, I'm a bird, so. Okay. I mean, as stealthy as a tiny bird would be. Mm -hmm. Probably pretty stealthy. Okay. Small, fast moving target. All right. Uh, my turn. Um, bird. Yes. So you hear the distinct sound of a bowstring being pulled. Dang. Well, there's nothing I can do about it. This would be. Oh, no. <laughs> an incredible shot, anyway. Nine. <laughs> That's about how it should. Does a nine hit you? That ya? might hit the bird. Uh, I don't know. Let me look it up. Yeah, probably tiny. No, you, you got, got a dance. 
Agility, dog. Oh. What is it's it? It's probably gonna be like a 13 or something. Yeah, 13. Okay. All so we should choose one, and you, you hear, um... <laughs> He's angry. <laughs> um... Do I see where that came from? Yeah, so as soon as he takes a shot, you can see him on this balcony, or stepping around this balcony up here. He, like, he knows where you guys are at, and then he sees this bird go flying up. So he's taking another shot. <laughs> Pull! <laughs> oh, there it is. That's, yeah, that's gonna hit. Dang. These guys are good. Eight piercing damage. Probably, that's probably it. Well, how high in the air are you? Uh, I don't know. 30 feet. So they suspected a bird? Well, he's got, like... So you hear it in the noise. He knows where you guys are. I'm the bird goes... By them 30. A bird that, that bird is suspicious. By a guy sh shooting an arrow at a bird. <laughs> You're 30 feet up. I'm 30 feet up, yeah. Yep. Holy cow. Let's take damage. Um, how much? How how much is that going to hurt? Thirty feet is how many d six? Three, three d six. Three. Oh, mm -hmm. Okay, you can take it. <laughs> Ball bird. I was bounce. thinking about coming out of hiding for you, but three d six. You can you can take that. How much damage did you do? Well, I only have one uh, HP anyways. Eight. So the seven goes to your druid. Yep, and I'll tuck and roll. <laughs> I got some momentum, I assume. Uh, yeah, yeah. A little momentum going. And you hear a, uh, you hear a shout of something, but you can only assume is, Got him! From the top of the tower. <laughs> wow. How much, how much does he take them from, uh, from the full? Oh, yeah. Do I, I need to roll. Yeah, go. The, you roll it. 3d6. I want to roll. Can I try to reduce it? <laughs> um, yeah, that's fine. You can do a, um, what's it, an acrobatics? Acrobatics. Acrobatics like fifteen to reduce, to reduce it by <laughs> half. <laughs> I'd be surprised if I got that. Uh. <laughs> uh. Yay! Uh. <laughs> there you go. I really did tuck and roll. I parkoured that landing. <laughs> <laughs> so, you, so we're already three d six and take half. ground is like a weird gross yellow green ish kind of color Isaac they traded him for a fourth round pick he's pretty old I guess but yeah. okay that bear's got a steal <laughs> for like two years that's a good player no they're anyway Okay. <clears throat> Saren, you're up. I am going to double move my 30 feet up to here. And then what can I do as a bonus action? I will just Use my movement to get up to there. Hey. Ready to my defenses. I will. Yeah, I'll just ready my defenses. Are you using an action? Nah, like I use my thing. action to okay. run. Eru, you're up. Uh, is that the only thing I've seen so far? Is the arrow coming off the top there? Yeah. And you oh, see, you saw him step back and try to like hide back there, but I think you. What's your? I don't know. Make my page up. What's your passive perception? 15. Yeah. Um, I forget what I rolled now. Um, Pretty sure it was a 2. You do not see him. He did He did tuck back okay. in. So I know he's in that vicinity, but he's gone somewhere else. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I will... 
bonus action dash. You're not stealthing right now? There. Or you are stealthing, right? Oh, I am. Yep. Uh, new information? Anything? Nope. All quiet. Almost like they've been alerted and they know you're there. Action dash to get up to there, I guess. I'm trying to stay behind stuff to be hidden. That's my turn. Okay, sunny cheeks. Move forward. 25 feet. Does it, is this wall actually like textured like this? Like yeah. really? Yeah. It's, it's, it's going to be an easy climb because it's not only is it like that, but it is just completely overgrown with vines. So I'm it's, actually going to Misty Step to this little ledge because I feel like that's a blind spot I'll say that that's doable but you're going to have it's going to be like squeezing so you're going to have like um, you know the negative effects of like I'm pretty small deck stuff <laughs> <clears throat> alright uh, turn into a spider <laughs> no I can't so I guess that is a pretty good ledge you're okay that's a good sized ledge awesome. there yeah, slide. it's a pretty good size. All right, cool. Hey, Krog. I'm going to run. Uh, that's it. Still, still uh, stealthing. <laughs> what? Difficult terrain. Zarek, you're up. <laughs> oh, boy. It's okay. <laughs> That's my turn. <laughs> I moved my ten feet. Oh, my Let's turn. go. <laughs> okay. Uh, done. So I got a nice line here. Uh oh. Um, arrow. You see a bow. Well, you don't really see it actually. You just see an arrow, I suppose. So an arrow is going to come flying out from the, from over here, which those of you with GMs can see this guy, but over here. Yeah. An arrow is flying out straight down the path to a Saren. Oh no. Oh snap. There is oh. an 11. Miss. And a 10. 10. No. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I prepared those defenses. <laughs> <laughs> and he he vanishes. <laughs> He's gone. Okay, uh... guy from up top. Um, what's he gonna do? He ain't gonna do nothing. Um, those of you with a. <clears throat> Anyone have a passive better than 17? 17 or higher? Uh, mine's 19. Okay, so you see a guy in the balcony up here. Guy in the balcony up there. <laughs> he moves like off the balcony as he hears that. <laughs> what? <laughs> <He's> like, <laughs> <laughs> um, so you see you see him up there, and he is like he is scanning carefully, scanning the um the the countryside. You think maybe looking for that little bird that he just shot that turned into oh. not, a, not a bird as it fell from the sky. Apparently they speak common. <laughs> they know the words for guy on the balcony up there. <laughs> Everybody speaks common. You're starting to sound so like common. you're starting to sound like those villagers. You think just because they're a bunch of wild elves, they don't know any better? <laughs> and here we are. We're just we're gonna try to have a conversation <laughs> with these boys before we kill them. Uh, I have a shot on that. It's so hard to see things in this dang forest. Um. Quentin Johnson gone now too. <laughs> Marquise Brown said to be with the Chiefs. 120. Oh. That's huge for them. Yeah. They needed they a had, quick guy. They had one receiver last year. So. <laughs> okay. Um, you also see a um, 
almost a shaman looking figure standing on the tower as well. Saren sees this. No one else sees this. I will let everybody know. Uh, hey. <laughs> a guy on the balcony up there. There's a guy up there. <laughs> They're like, we know. We, you already told us this. <laughs> you don't understand. <laughs> There's a new one up there. He looks like a shaman. He looks like he might cast a spell on you. <laughs> Okay, you hear a as a very old door, which miraculously is still on its hinges, opens up. And build them like they used to, you know? <laughs> uh, Saren, <laughs> I don't think anyone else can see this. I don't know where I don't know. Well, I guess Krog can see this. Maybe. The door opens up and you see a a weapon, a we oh, sword wielding elf step out. Saren, you are you are up. So you got uh, you got two on the top, at least two down below. Keep Sunny on. cheeks, you hear a uncomfortable skittering sound inside the tower. Mm -hmm. It's Buren. <laughs> He's just back there, like doing tap dances. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try and hide behind this tree, but double move and just like stand behind it, so I'm trying not to get shot. Okay. Eru. Um, is the the stone here? Is it also difficult terrain? Uh, no. You know, we'll say that the um, yeah, anything other than the stone and the platform here, this is all good. We'll let that be. Okay. In that case, I will step here and then move up. Um, still stealthing, so I'm twenty. Uh, any new information from here? I don't um, yeah, you can see the, that hole there. You can see that guy. There's a guy there with a sword. Uh, he's got Ooh. a... He has a long sword. He actually has a long sword um, and, a, and a dagger in his hand. I'm going to bonus action dash, but I'm, and I'm not going to do anything this turn. I'm just going to hang out in here, still hidden, and that's my turn. Okay, Sunny Cheeks. Alright, I'm going to uh, go over to this other little rock right here. That wouldn't be too hard, right? That one will be a little more difficult. Like That's going to be the squeezing one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I can climb there pretty easily. Yeah, yeah, like, no This problem. is all pretty cli easily climbable. Yeah, if you want to go up, I'll just make you do a quick check, but as long as you don't like fumble, you're fine. Um, how hard would it be to, like, just take a peek around this corner so I can see that guy up there? Climb up a little bit, peek around the corner. Um. Just hold on the rope like Jurassic Park style. That's, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> um, you're not, you're not stealth, right? No, not necessarily. Okay. Um. Yeah, I mean, that's easily do easily done. want to blast him with call lightning. Does that have Are you I know. I'm, I'm about to, I'm about to. <laughs> Are you peeking your head around the corner? <laughs> well, now I'm not. Well, now I'm not. Why would you say it <laughs> like you, that? He, your uh, ninth level druidness tells yeah. you this guy didn't fire last turn. <laughs> he yeah. Has an action that he didn't use. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna peek around the corner, you then. <laughs> right here. You're welcome. Actually. Oh man, that's a, how much more lenient than I would have been. <laughs> you peek your yeah, head around the corner. You should have just let me peek around the corner. Totally, totally should have let that happen. Uh, I'm gonna go up a little bit then to this ledge kind of hide. If I can, I'm going to pull myself up here and hide behind this wall right here. Um, are you going to, are you, okay, give me a, you're in stealth. Yeah. I think I can get into that space without being seen. Give me a stealth. 
I don't know why I'm so confident. My stealth is not that great. <laughs> I think Ooh, I can do you're it. You're at 10. <clears throat> so as you climb up there and you think, I'm, I'm being a little noisy, but a little noisier than I should be, but I should be okay. And you climb yeah. up and, and as you get to the top, your head just crests unwill unwittingly. <laughs> Your head yeah. just crests the top, and you yeah. hear a, huh? from a female elven voice, <laughs> as she also had something prepared, and you hear the beginnings of a what? sound of a cast, and oh, man. A, a black bolt shoots out of her fingers, Ooh. and she says, she shouts something out. Should have worn an apple on top of your head. I know. Does a 15 hit you? Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, does he have cover? Uh, yes, he does. Half or three quarters? He's, I'm going to say you got plus five to your cover. Oh, okay. well then no, that doesn't hit me. Okay. <laughs> so. Nice. Thanks um, for that save, boss. Yeah, so she shoots that out <laughs> and this just explodes on the, uh, the rock right where your head is. And I go, eat. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just full commit. I just pull myself up and blast her. Uh, you cannot, because you tried to stealth. Oh, you're right. Dang. I guess I'm going to chill right here. <laughs> Cling to the edge? No, I'm going to pull myself up and, like, just crouch on that ledge. That okay. pretty sizable ledge right there. Be like... Okay, <laughs> sizable ledge. Cover's all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Krog, you're up. All right, I'm going to... So you said I see that guy at the at the door? Um, yeah, you see the guy with the swords at the door. Okay. And you see there's someone that's coming out behind him as well. And you can see, you see the, I think, what's your passive perception? I should get my with 14. Okay, so you don't see the archer up here, but you do see the, the caster that just blasted your friend. Tried to. All right. I'm going to keep moving up then. Slowly but surely. Uh, yeah, that's it. If you want to give up your stealth, you can move a little faster. I don't know. I kind of like it right now. <laughs> I'm just trying to get you in the game, Krog. Well, I, I, want, want I want you to come back next week, Francisco. I don't want you to... <laughs> <I> don't want <laughs> you They'll never let me play. play. This is the perfect moment for you, man. You just start running across. They shoot an arrow at you. You catch it like a boss and throw it straight throw back, it back at them. Throw it back at them. <laughs> I could. Might He's do like, that next you're time. right. <laughs> I, do, I do like catching arrows. It's the best. <laughs> it is. All right. Where's my character at? I lost him. There he is. I'm so far away. I can only move 15 feet per turn. You could do the same thing, but without catching the arrow part, because you're not, you don't <laughs> got that ability. You can catch it in your teeth. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you catch it in your teeth. Or on your face or in your chest <laughs> he's got a shield right he just holds the shield up like this he doesn't have a shield it's <laughs> right in the clavicle i do have a shield oh did you I find did you find one? Oh yeah yeah you have your shield bought yeah. one. right right he bought right. one yeah all right Done? yeah uh yeah that's my turn are you did you move or are you still stealthing i'm still stealthing okay my turn um so we'll deal with the top of the tower first we're going to let, um, she's going to come over here and she's going to jump up on this ledge ah. for all the world to see. And you can see her, she's got like, oh, like black eyeshadow, you know, she's clearly an evil sorcerer. Black eyeshadow. <laughs> um, That's all it takes. That's all it takes. <laughs> <laughs> and she begins to cast a spell and you see this time both hands black veins and two black bursts of nasty come flying oh, out. Man. Oh, that was close. Four, <laughs> that was on one and then it rolled over. Uh, 19. Yeah, that hits. And a... a no? no, he didn't have cover with her there. Um, okay. And an 18. What was it? 19 no, oh, and yeah, eight, all, 19. All those, yeah, both those hit me. Okay, so you've got... My AC is 13. So these this bolt of necrotic... Nasty comes out of her hands. There, oh no! Oh man! There is twenty damage from the first one. From the, the first, first one? one? <laughs> <Holy> <laughs> <man>. <laughs> Thirteen I'm from the second wrong. one. It's like, oh, bam, bam, bam! I'm not dead. 
<laughs> she's Did gonna you lose your balance? Plop back down over here. Oh, no. And she is shouting something at this guy at the window. And so... What is she saying? You don't know. She's saying, shoot that guy. <laughs> so he's going to come around he's here. He's gonna, there's a handy for. stool right here for him to step up uh, on. He's going to stand right over there. He he's uh, he tosses his bow down and draws his... What do you have? He draws a short sword. And he, you can see him. Uh, scar impression. Yeah, he steps right up above you and just <laughs> straight down on your, I know. your I little gnomish to head. I need to see if I have any reactions. What a massacre. I, like I know, I'm getting freaking brutalized. Holy I, I cow. Say, you're going to be dead soon. Oh, yeah. no. So there's, <laughs> that's sunny cheeks. There's a 23 <laughs> for seven damage. I'm dead. <laughs> Why don't you give me a... Um, hmm. Just give me... A... charitable. I'm going to fall off the side of the building. <laughs> Give me do a. Land, do, you, do you collapse on the ledge or do you collapse? Uh, on that's the, the question. Field. How how did he hit you? Did he swing down and hit you, or did he just did he stab oh and kick? Gosh. Um, give me uh, a uh, just give me a deck save. We'll say as long as you make a ten. Well, we'll make a fifteen. Make a fifteen. You stay on the ledge. You're tangled up. Oh enough. man, oh, no. he's falling off. I, I am going. <laughs> Yep. Oh, okay. Down no. he goes. Oh, no. This is the worst. Mew. Bunk. Ouch. So it was only like, like that's like one. Is that a death? That's that was 10 feet. So it's it's a death death one, 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 one. Do we need to roll it to see if I land on this or fall down one more time? <laughs> <laughs> no, you, <laughs> you didn't roll <laughs> <wear> one. <laughs> oh, man. Man. Listen, I'm like John Wick. I'll just bounce back. He's gonna, he's gonna pop back off of his ledge and disappear behind the thing. Okay. Oh man. Um, that's not good. Do I have a sight on? Uh, oh, I do. Um, oh, Krog, you're still stealthing, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, Krog, I'm trying to hit you here. Everyone is except for Saren. Yeah, and I can't see Saren. Oh, I think man. we should all just run out into the open. <laughs> At this point, I mean, we all just saw sunny uh, cheeks fall out from a sunny from cheeks. the top. <laughs> <laughs> you see this bird fly up, <laughs> and then you see the little druid yeah. climbing up the thing. <laughs> it's bad. It's bad. I've been having a rough day. Oh man. So arrow, you're standing there, and you see this elf just go rolling right by your window here. And stand over here. All He's right. got a longsword and a dagger. Um. Where'd it go? My dice go. Oh, I cleared him. Oh, <laughs> I was like, he disappeared <laughs> in midair. What happened to it? <laughs> okay, so I, this guy's gonna climb up this edge here. Very good roll on his on his uh, climb check. Nice. Um, I think Krog, everyone except for oh, Sunny Cheeks and, and Arrow can see him climb up this, this fire pole, kind of climb up this way. Okay, okay Saren, you're up. <clears throat> Man, I can't do nothing. Take I'm wading through the, 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 the snow leage. <laughs> I will get up through there. <laughs> Try and hide behind this tree. And I'll um, my turn there. Okay, as you get to about that point to where he has a sight on you, you got good cover, but he's still going to take a shot. It is a readied shot. Um, you're plus five. That's a 24. Silvery bars. Ah! Uh. 20. Is that what I just rolled? Did I do the math wrong? No. Uh, uh, 23. Uh, hits. Okay. I give advantage to myself. How selfish of you? Taking five <laughs> points of piercing damage. Oh, man. Oh, I rolled the wrong... Hang on. Hang on. That's the wrong bow. Wrong, wrong dice. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. Eight points of piercing damage. Yeah. 
Uh, golly. Okay, Eru, uh, no, sorry. Uh, yeah, Eru, you're up. Okay. <clears throat> so, and um, this guy over here, you know there's one just on the other side of this wall of you, and there's one on the other side of this wall on this side. So you've got both sides, okay? Okay. Um, and you've got I'm just going to take upstairs as well. Step here. And I'm going to booming blade this fellow in the back. Oh, man. Here we go. It's yeah. gonna blow up. Natural nineteen. That's a hit. So okay, so that's D eight, forty six, this. And he needs to make a con save. He made it. Eleven. Eleven? Okay. Mm. So he takes half of this, right? Yeah. So he takes twenty three. 24 points of damage, uh, piercing and a little thunder. And then he takes four points of poison damage. Okay. And I am going to run over here and bonus action hide. He's shouting out something along the lines of there's one over here, but in a different language. Um, actually, I'm going to run. Boy, that's the worst stealth I've rolled in a while. 18. 18? Oh, that's not very good. <laughs> Thanks, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> my guy, my guy, they're all that's, lousy. That's just not very good. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Sonny Teeks, you're up. This makes up for that last combo uh, when I couldn't hit save. anything. <laughs> yeah, death save. Oh, no. Uh, no. Oh, no. That's two. Krog. I... Greg, I say you just run. I'm gonna run. You can catch all the arrows. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna... <laughs> 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 we'll see. Uh... <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, I'm gonna get, get out of stealth, and I'm just gonna run 40 up to here, and... Okay, around the point you get to around there-ish... Uh-huh. An arrow comes a-flying from yes. the guy on the balcony. I get excited. <laughs> With a 17. <laughs> 17. Okay, I haven't done this in a while. How does this work again? Uh, well, if it hits, then you can roll your whatever to see. Uh, it, it takes away the damage, and if it takes away all of it, then you can throw it back if you want. Okay, so... What do I have to roll First, for you this? have to know if it hits, which is a 17, I think? Uh, yeah, 17 hits, yes. And then, so, so I roll 1d10. Okay, well, I, so I roll a 1d10 plus 14. That's for, for damage? Stone's Endurance, right? Oh, wait, no. Deflect missiles, missiles. Says, you can use your reaction to deflect or catch a missile when you're hit by... When you do so, the damage you take from the attack is reduced by... Like One D ten plus fourteen. If you reduce the damage to zero, have a free hand. You can spend one key point. Oh to, wow! Okay. Yeah. So I give so, you damage. Go ahead and give you damage then. Just yeah. Now. Yeah. Five. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no need to even roll. You can turn yeah. back if you want to. I'm gonna roll anyways. Uh, why not? I just. Gotta why roll not? Dice, dude. Boom. Seventeen. Okay. So, so I'm going to. Throw it back. I'm going throw to throw it, it back. back. You've got, yes. um, you can see, uh, do you have to throw it back at him or can you pick? Uh, says, if you reduce a, you can spend one key point to make a ranged attack with a range of 20 slash 60. That's anybody. So it's going to, it's 60 feet though. Is, it's going to be definitely outside of 20. So you, yeah. can hit, you can hit anyone except for, anyone on the, on the ground or up oh. on this balcony here. So any of the, you can, any of these three, you can see all three of them, and you got a clear shot. On I'll hit the them. guy. I'll hit the guy that. Uh, this is the one that shot at you. Okay, I'll hit the guy that um, that was poisoned. Okay. Okay, so it's this. Let me see if it'll let me. 
Okay, so it's a 1d20 plus 9. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Did I roll a fumble oh, no. on that? How's that work? How does that even work? Uh... It's a ranged attack. You just oh, no. like you just what, like what happens? So I just open break your there. hand too early and the arrow falls straight. <laughs> so you back. grab this arrow and you go to throw it. Man. It says if attack well. It's a what? Uh, I'm trying to see if this fits. Okay. That's throw your arm out. Hilarious. Your Tommy John surgery. So you throw it and you manage like you throw it, but it cuts you as you throw it. You take another uh, five damage. Okay. He <laughs> <laughs> could have just like taken the arrow and done the same. Arrow. I yeah, literally. That's just, yeah. <laughs> so do I? So I? It, it doesn't even hit him. Nope. He just plops okay. in the ground in front of you. All right. Uh, splinter. That's the worst splinter ever. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put it's your hand in the pain. jalapenos. <laughs> <laughs> that's it for my turn. All right, Zarek, you're up. Okay. I'm going to do exactly water. what Krog did. I'm going to get out of stuff. Zurich thinks this is bullcrap. Oh, like, now he quit. I, I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> walked away. Dang, he's got a nice chair. Look at that thing. Oh, Dang. Bam. It's very poofy. It looks classy. <laughs> Are you uh, you're coming out of stealth? <laughs> yes. Okay. Tired of... Zurich got tired of being slow. It is my oh, turn. No. <laughs> I'll save the uh, Krog killing. Um, I can't <laughs> see anybody else. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, so we got no, Guy you can't. Guy in Balcony. He's going to pop over here. He's going to take a couple shots at Zareek. You got two arrows flinging at you. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. my god! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Can I see that guy? <clears throat> um, Where are you at? I don't know. Oh, back over here. I don't know if you can if you got a sight on that. Okay, Sarah, please. I can't. Um, Dang it. <laughs> let me see here. I don't know. I can't move my hair. Let me see if I can see you from his angle. There's like a big hunk of stone right here. Um. Oh, no. No, I see you. Yep, you can see him. Ah, uh, no. Okay, I will silvery barbs one of those and give myself advantage. Okay. So the first one still hits with a natural 20. <laughs> yeah. The second one's going to be an 11. Now that misses. Okay. All right. Okay, so this arrow comes in like and it, 70 it, damage. <laughs> it sticks you in the arm. Oh, it hurts. Okay. Um. <clears throat> oh, that's bad. Okay. I'm gonna die like Boromir. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're gonna take. Uh, it's just oh, ten no. damage. It's a clean shot okay. though. It goes straight through you. And give me a d6. Oh no. I don't want to. It went want to straight roll through like the, the the squishy part of your arm. One. Okay, you are taking one bleed damage every turn until you spend an action oh, to fix oh. it. Oh, real bad. And oh, okay. you just lost one con point. Oh, oh what? man, Dang. that's brutal. <laughs> Good thing you rolled a one. <laughs> <laughs> The one wow. con was anyway. The bleed was the dice roll. Oh. oh. Well, still a good thing you roll a one. <laughs> so, you don't take the bleed damage right now, but at the beginning of your turn, every turn, you're going to take one. It's going to cost an action okay. to fix it up. I'm not, there's no check. It just takes an action or a magical heal will fix it. Okay. Um, she's going to pop up on this stool here. And let's see. She sees a Krog and she sees a little Zareek. Does she see a. Um, yeah, she sees a Saren there, but he's kind of behind a tree. I'm gonna go with. I am no longer stealthed. Are you I not? Cast silvery barbs. Oh yeah. Oh, wow. I'm hoping I have some cover from. I'm taunting all the archers. So, one and two is gonna be Eru. Three and four is Arik. Five and six, Krog. Not a one or two. <laughs> okay. Dang it! <laughs> she pops up and she's like, oh. You hear her say something, and you think it means, oh, you're not stealth anymore. <laughs> and she um, is going to throw out... Hang on. Okay, so what's going to happen is she begins to cast a spell. And oh, I'd prefer she didn't. 
This is a spell you have seen before. Uh, um, what does that mean? <laughs> so she's going to put it right on top of you. I don't want her to do that. Make sure her uh -oh. friend is not quite in it. And all of a sudden, everyone sees this, and there's just blackness. Just just a black bubble appears over where Eru is. Oh, yeah. Eru, while you're in there, um, you are, you just, blackness and bitter cold is all around you. You see nothing. And you hear, like, whispers in the background. Slurping sound. <laughs> Just all, all in this <laughs> thing. <for> <laughs> oh, uh. A cacophony of soft whispers and slurping noises. <laughs> it's like an ASMR video. Isn't there? <laughs> yeah. um, I'm, like in a, I'm in a, a ramen library. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like there's a sensation of some sort of tentacle rubbing against you. Um. <laughs> there you go. That's not good. <laughs> it was all good until the tentacles showed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything was fine until that. Yeah, I can eat here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. It's hot outside now. It's cool. <laughs> all right, Krog, we got uh, arrow number one and two at you. Okay. Uh, that's a that's a that's a twenty and a nineteen. Uh, yes and yes. Yeah, you gonna try to catch them? They're going back at me. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt. Let's see what the damage is first. Oh, yeah. uh, so here's damage number one. Ooh, where'd that go? <coughs> okay. So there's six That's damage, one. and the other one is a five damage. So six and five. I, he doesn't have a reaction left, right? Huh? Oh, is that a, re is that a reaction? Is it? Yeah. Uh, okay. I thought it was a key point thing. Okay. It's a key point to throw it back, but it is a reaction to catch it. Okay. Yeah, you don't have a reaction. Is it? Oh, okay. You just constantly catch it. Uh, it says I can just use my reaction. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, and you get one of those. So I get one of those. One per round. So yeah, it basically just resets at your round at your turn. Okay. Uh, so. So nine piercing total. Nine piercing total. Okay. All um, right. and you got dude on balcony. He's gonna do the same thing. Two shots. Two hits. Okay. For a... Ooh, that's better. Um, plus four. So 12 and 9. Okay. Ooh. Okay. And... <coughs> hmm. He's gonna, away from me. He's gonna get away from me slurping sounds and things. So <laughs> me. He's gonna come back. back uh, I don't know. He's gonna come over here. He's gonna hang out here. Just waiting. Okay, is everybody? Yeah. Saren, you're up. She's not good. See this little bead of a soul that is escaping Sunny Teak's body up there on the ledge. Yep. Yeah. You need a Patronus. I'm going Patronus to. Right a really good one. I'm going to cast Mass Cure Wounds. I'm gonna put it right <clears throat> here, so both of them will get healed. Nice. Full health. Either way, I gotta. It's the only ranged <laughs> heal I have. Come wow. on. Isaac, you also you are blinded in there for the sake of uh, game stuff. I figured. Where is it? Seventeen points of healing to both oh. of you. I'm like, oh, that felt nice. What was that? For? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
And I'm gonna bolt. Tentacle? Tentacle. <laughs> tentacle here. Was that you? <laughs> oh no. So I can get to like there. I'm back. Wake up and there's just a big black dome to your to your bottom right. I'm just, I'm just gonna see that. I'm gonna open my eyes and I'm gonna be like, ugh, ugh. I look down and I'm just I'm just gonna lay. <laughs> Sounds like a ramen library down there. <laughs> you done, Joe? I don't like all those yeah. slurping noises. Eru, you're up. Uh, Eru, you're it's gonna polite. Take, um, 2d6. Is there a save I need to make? Um, you're in difficult terrain. Any creature starts a turn there, take 2d6 cold damage. Only if you end your turn there do you need to make any sort of uh, saves. Oh. Which is strange. So that's a no save 2d6, huh? All right. No save All right. 2d6. Four damage! Yeah. Ow. <laughs> it's a tentacle in tentacle just start licking you. <laughs> uh, okay. So. I, I know which, which way is which, though, right? I'm not running... Like in random directions, I can remember. No, what yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Okay. Like you can't see the tree or the column, but you know where you're at. Also, you don't know, so how, you don't know will, how big it is, but you know that's you're good. I will bonus action dash and get to this wall over here. There's twenty two feet, twenty feet. So I'm out of it now. Mm hmm. And I see that guy over there. Do you ignore? Do you ignore um, all difficult terrain? Is that your thing? Says, if I if I if I dash. Okay. Which I did. Even like even magical <clears throat> magical difficult terrain is. I will double check. And not just uh, foresty yeah. difficult terrain. When you use the dash action, difficult terrain doesn't cost you any extra movement on that turn. Okay. That's what it says. Okay. Um. So that's twenty feet. I will then move over here. By the way, that spell was cast by a Nostra, a long time ago. Oh, right. Uh, but that was cast from up here? Yeah, from the lift, the top. I will booming blade this fellow here. Okay. Again. Seventeen plus a bunch. Yeah, it's a hit. Oh, he needs to take, because he moved uh, last round, right? Yeah. So he takes... Four points of thunder damage. Okay. And then this is for the attack I just made. This plus three. 24 points of damage. Dang. Okay. He's still there. I don't need to make my save. I already used it already, didn't you? I used it. Yeah. And I'll be like, um, oh. <laughs> so you stab him and he, you're like, man, this guy can't have much left. But his action was ready. So he's going to turn around and stab you right back. Okay. No, he's not. He's gonna try to. <laughs> oh, too fast for you. Uh, and then I'm going to step back right here and listen to the lovely slurping while I <laughs> just sit right against this wall and try to get cover from anything on that side. And that'll be my turn. Okay, sunny cheeks. I am going Sunny to. Sunny Cheeks is alive. I'm alive. I hear Sunny Cheeks up there. Ah, oh, Sunny <laughs> Cheeks. It's real gross in there. Don't go in there. <laughs> in where? In, in the slurpy hole over there. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, it sounds disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to crawl up here uh, as I'm saying that. <laughs> uh, I'm going to cast Call Lightning, fourth level. Hit both of these guys. Give me a deck save. Where's my Where's my storm? It's not a that's not a good storm one, is there? What? Oh, like, like the storm the sound? There's a rain one. There's no like thunder. Like thunder, thunder. yeah. Oh, ambient. There you go. There was. There's your storm. Okay, who's making saves? Everybody. Uh, just those two guys at the at the bottom. These two. Those two. Just yeah. those two. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Here's the archer. 
What do you, is this a dex? Yeah. Okay, so that's a 17. And a 17. Plus right, 4, plus 3. Take half damage. Oh, no, actually, plus he's higher than that. Both take 8 damage. 8 damage. Okay, so you blast this guy with a bolt, and he he drops down. Nice. <laughs> nice. He thought he dodged. <laughs> but he was standing in a puddle. So the lightning Can't dodge him. lightning. <laughs> um, Eru, as you uh, walked up to this guy, um, I forgot to tell you, that he didn't have... His face is a little bit... He's an elf, but he's not the same type of elf as these other elves. He looks more... Looks more like you. Just from his eyes. He's got his face covered, but you can see his eyes. He has, okay. it looks more like you. Sorry, I meant to say that and I forgot. Done sunny cheeks. I am. Krog! Um, I'm gonna run up. Double move. there. And then that's it. Okay, Zarek. Okay. Take your bleed damage. How much is that? Well, just one, right? One. Does that does your con lower you any? Uh it's a twelve, so I don't think it does. It is a twelve. Oh, it's plus one, isn't it? It's a twelve well, it's a thirteen now and it goes down to twelve. Okay. So it's 12 so, now. Yeah, you're fine. <clears throat> awesome. Uh, I'm just going to continue running. I can I can deal with the deep bleeding thing later. <laughs> later. Ain't when you're dead. Okay, this, this uh, <laughs> if you guys missed this before, this stone platform here is not difficult to ring. Okay. Everyone get to the runway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh. The stone and like the the wood in here, all good. Well, it is now though because of the slurping. But I get what an extra <laughs> foot before. Oh, that. Ooh, it got all dark. It Gosh. got dark. There you go. Now it's raining. What? The druid is here. I don't like being wet. <laughs> you done? That's unfortunate, David. For you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, my turn. Okay. Uh, we'll start at the top. We're going to go... Um, she's going to pop up here on the ledge. Oh, who's she going to hit? She's got that pesky druid right there in the game, doesn't she? Moving around again. No no way she knows I'm alive. <laughs> You're over there casting spells. saw lightning yeah. come down from the sky <laughs> out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah. It got dark. She yeah. don't know that. <laughs> I'm like... laying there softly. I'm still dead looking. I'm playing dead. <laughs> she begins to cast a spell. <laughs> and you <laughs> concentrating on a spell is opening one eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have disadvantage on that because you're you're a prone. Um oh, oh, yeah, the prone's working out. <laughs> Plus five. So uh, um <laughs> eleven. No, that does not hit me. Hey, she's got another one coming at you then. Oh no! Oh, yes! <laughs> she curses. She's... Crone is the greatest. <laughs> you don't, you don't understand what she said, but right you strategy. but you heard Sunny Cheeks as she steps off the ledge. <laughs> <laughs> she knows my name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got an arrow coming at Saren. We got two arrows at Saren from the dude in the top. Ultimate defense. Lie still. <laughs> um, these are both plus six, so fourteen. Does that hit you? Nope. Okay, mm -hmm. we got dude uh, here is gonna pop out. Gonna blast that Krog. Two arrows. Now you can try to defend one of them. Uh, there's the other one. Is it 12? 12 doesn't hit you, does it? No. The first so one. I'll does. just grab. I'll try to grab the one that does. Okay. For five damage. <laughs> you can't roll higher than a two on that D8. <laughs> nope. Unless it's Eric, then I can blast him. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> I'm about so to say I got 16. freaking. Okay, <laughs> so. <laughs> Oh, I'll, I'll show this uh, back and take damage. 
I'm gonna try and redeem myself. Uh, yeah, I'll throw it back. <laughs> I'll use a key point. Okay. Let's see how this goes. All right. Uh, you should take my AC, right? On your attack? Uh, yeah, so... It's 1d20 plus... How far away is he now? Nine, so, 20. He's within range now. Oh, he's within 20 is a hit. Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's gonna be 1d6 plus 5. Throw it at his shoulder. Uh, 7. Okay, yeah, right back into his, right back into his shoulder. <laughs> yeah. Squeaks a little bit and steps back. Mr. Gun, that is so cool, Croc. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, guy up here doesn't have a really good shot on anybody. He thought he was cool climbing up there. Uh oh. Um, <laughs> probably move over here though. And get a shot. Yeah. There you go. So one pops over here on this ledge over here. He's going to take one uh, at Krog. Two shots. Yeah. There's a hit. One hit, anyway. Yeah. Five damage. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Man. Okay. Okay, Saren, you're up. I am going to... Not see anyone. Wait, can I see the guy up top? Uh, yeah, you the one you can see that one, and you can see yeah you can see that one. Okay. You might get uh, yeah that's all you got. Got cover on you, but but you can see him. I'm gonna cast guiding bolt at fourth level with advantage because I have silver barbs. Nineteen. That's a hit. Twenty-three. Man, D and D Beyond are rolling natural twenty. <laughs> it's like the third <laughs> time tonight. <laughs> He's gonna take. Those dice exploded. Twenty-nine rating. Twenty-nine. Okay. Nice. Hey, you see this guy just get fried, and he's like leaning over the rail. Uh, he Ooh. picks himself back up, but he is real bad. <laughs> wow. Gonna... The resilience. Take off here. And get next to that wall and try and <clears throat> use it for cover. You hear this slurping sounds and laughter oh. coming from the uh, the bubble. <laughs> Someone thinks from slurping is funny. <laughs> <laughs> Arrow, you're up. Okay. <laughs> um, I will I know there's I know that this guy is here right yep okay so I will I'll bonus action hide and then walk uh, through that door come around here go through that hole there yeah And booming blade, this fellow. Oh, I gotta, I gotta stealth first. See if I'm hidden. Nineteen. Yeah, you are. Okay. Ha. Uh, fifth twenty-two. Twenty-two is a hit. Yeah. Twenty-seven. Pull ass, this guy. He explodes and goes toppling forward into the into the pathway. He explodes. And then I will use the rest of my movement to go back over here. You need to be more like Sam Fisher. That is my turn. Like doing a double backflip to get up to this guy up here, so you can stealth kill him. <laughs> okay, Sunny Cheeks, you're up. <laughs> I'm going to turn into a tiny little spider, and I'm going to crawl along the wall like this and then i'm going to use call lightning on that guy on the ledge <laughs> <laughs> where's this lightning coming from you see this little spider shaking his fist <laughs> <laughs> i got two legs up like this ah, that's, a, boom. that's a dex 14 that's a fail i looked up to see if i could actually do that 17 damage they're not both bonus actions. 
Uh, it's, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I couldn't do it. No, it takes a. It's a full action to use call lightning. Yeah. So you mm-hmm. couldn't do that because you're not a moon druid. Oh, it's not a bonus action to transform, is it? Nope. Not for anything yeah, but a moon right. druid. Dang. Never mind. I turn into a little spire and I crawl on the side of the wall and I'm thinking about hitting that guy with <laughs> okay. You're getting your little arms ready. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you done? Yeah. Are you're up you're up around the wall here, I'll put you flying so you can put yourself wherever however high you yeah, want to be. Sweet. Crawl, you're up. Uh <laughs> So you can see the one that's on the ledge up there? Yeah, I see that. And you know one. and you also see the one that is that Saren that Joe just hit on the ledge up there. <laughs> Here, uh, Kat's like spinning around on the high I know, I know. I was getting him set up. <laughs> I'm gonna... Okay, how... If I, incre- if I increase my, my jump to double jump, how far up can I go? Is that a key point thing? Uh, it's... Um, um, it's, uh, Step of the Wind. Key point, yeah. Because my jump distance is doubled. Um, so you can jump, like, your... What's your height? Like, your high jump is, like, half your strength score or something? If you just stand... Is that what you mean, like, standing jump? Yeah, like, if I wanted to jump from there to You want to jump up on the ledge? Like, over here. Um... I'm going to say that's, let's see, like it's, it's, e- it's easy to climb. It's just half movement climbing it. It's an easy climb. Easy climb. Um, but if you want to jump it, we'll say that you're, what is your strength score? Uh, 16. Okay. So normally I think you can jump. I think, it's, I think, is it right? Am I as half your strength? So long score? jump. Uh, you cover a number of feet up to your strength score. That's long. He wants to go up. 10 foot, 10 feet. Okay, high jump is, <clears throat> when you make a jump in the area, three plus your strength modifier. Three plus my strength. If you five. move at least 10 foot on foot immediately before the jump, uh, then you get the three plus uh, your strength modifier. If you make a standing high jump, it's only half that distance. And your, your, your modifier is a, you're a 16. Yeah. So you can, just, you can jump 7 feet, so you can jump 14 feet with that? Okay, so 14 feet. Plus it, 3 plus your modifier is if you run and do it. But he's if got... You're just standing, it's half of that. But he doubles his, his jump distance. Oh, okay. So, so yeah, what, like 14 plus 3 if I run? So you can get you can get it to up there. And then you can just... What we're saying is you can really dunk on people. <laughs> yeah, so you can you can run and basically it's going to save you a lot of it'll save you a lot of half movement. You can run in there. Jump up to And jump up there? Yeah, just okay. as, just as part of your move and so you've only got like what's that 5 feet. So an, just an extra 10, 10 foot of movement to get up to the top. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do. So how do I how do I go up? Do uh, I forgot how to do it. Uh, I can't click you with this thing. There you go. So okay. we go up here. So then, yep. Yeah, right. up there. And that's that for me. Okay, so that that see this um, behemoth runs yeah, through, jump over me, so <laughs> stuck on a wall and start climbing. I'm like, holy jeez! <laughs> so you can do all that. I wanted to try that. You can do all that with just move action. You still have a standard, and you still have another whatever. That's just a move action to get there. You move okay. forty feet, right? Uh, step of the wind is what you use to double your jump, right? Yeah. Is that a bonus? That's your. That's a bonus action. So you still have you still have an action. Okay, so I still have an action. So can I uh, can I start climbing then? Yeah, yeah. Just have okay. mo- half movement. Up half movement. Thing. Just um, roll an athletics. Don't roll a one. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, Incoming one. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm worried about. Athletics. Athletics. No, uh, not two 18. ones. Okay. <laughs> That's two ones. That's even worse. <laughs> so yeah, you can climb just fine. Okay. Just half movement. Okay, so I'm going to be... Oh, half movement. Yep. Then I will be... Right at the top. Right yep. at the top. Uh, if I can... 
It'll be like right not a good there. Idea to end up right yeah, there. it'll just be right there at the edge. <laughs> you see her, and she slowly <laughs> turns. <laughs> well, bye, bye. Oh, you again. A... <laughs> we've been that we've been here before. Zarek, you're up. Okay. Huge move <laughs> So there's thirty. Should I move another thirty, or should I fix myself? That can wait. I'm moving another thirty. Just take your uh, your bleed. Uh, in about two seconds. Okay, one point. There we go. Zirk will live. You guys see Zirk running by, and there's just this trail of blood. <laughs> and a hole. In, a, flesh wound. a hole in his arm. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Bleed on me? <laughs> Okay, so dude on ledge. He sees a uh, a fresh Zarek. Two shots. Pew pew. Oh no. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> I'm still probably gonna take damage though. Since. Um. Um. I'm trying to see how to do this one. I'll just do it this way. So, let me get a different one. Ah! Okay. Thanks, Maxwell. Uh, so we'll do the damage first, and then I'll do the, f the fumble. So you're taking six damage from the bow. Hang on. What is that 16 out of two? Huh? What? He wants to he make got sure a 16. Oh, 22. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> hey, wait a oh yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, six damage you said. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Still fine. Uh -huh. So the second one goes and it like he he banks it off something, maybe the spider on the wall or something, and it banks and it flies <laughs> straight up in the air. <laughs> and I have to make a deck save <clears throat> as this arrow's flying back towards him. He went straight up and it's coming right back down. He dodges, steps out of the way, but he goes prone. That's impressive. Avoids the arrow, slamming in the ground. But he goes prone. He's just going to stand back up them. Okay. <laughs> Could have been bad. I could have gotten hit Hold by down. He stands up. <laughs> that was impressive. Okay, dude in balcony um, sees a giant crog. I'll give you, you got plus two cover on this guy. He's going to take two shots at you, though. Um, one's gonna hit. Can I reaction grab? Yeah. Okay. He's gonna hit yeah, you for damage. ooh, nine damage. <laughs> nine damage. All right. <laughs> you have yet to hit him for anything that he actually has to roll for. <laughs> Eight. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna use a key point. He's. And I'm gonna throw it. He's gonna have cover. Like a, he's gonna have a plus two, but she does not. Yeah, I'm gonna throw it at her. Okay. Boom. Um. <laughs> also, Zarek doesn't doesn't have cover from you either. If you want, if just in case you're wondering. Oh yeah, <laughs> Zarek. <clears throat> oh yes. Oh no. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> right between oh, the eyes. Oh man. I'm gonna. I wanna. Oh, I wanna. This does she have to use a weapon to cast spells? No, but I uh, I guarantee this is this is gonna be better than what you're. This oh, is, okay. this is gonna do worse <laughs> than what you. Great. <laughs> <laughs> this is a bad one. Okay. Okay. Um, give me normal damage. Normal damage. All right. One d six. Oops. One d six plus five. It really is gonna be right between the eyes. Oh man. Uh, six. <laughs> you roll a one. Yeah. <laughs> he took a lesson from you on how to roll. Okay. Give me. Damage. Give me a d four. <laughs> so you grab this uh -oh. arrow and you and you turn and you chuck it straight at her, and she is a little shocked by this. As it yeah. comes straight for her face, Ooh. and it goes through her cheek, and <laughs> out the other side, and you see her grab her face. Oh, um, ouch. As she takes, was that two? Yeah. Blood everywhere. Ooh. Um, And you feel like, oh, you probably got her tongue pretty good. She probably can't cast spells with verbal components very well. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Dang. That's brutal. So she's grab, grabbing her mouth, blood all streaming, streaming down. Is she, uh, does she have to make a concentration check on Slurpy McGee down here? Oh, yeah. Slurpy Slurpy McGee. She fails her concentration. Yes! 
So all you hear is just, out here. she's just screaming up there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so my turn, you. isn't it? So then she is now very angry. And so Uh-oh. with her 50% fail failure chance, she's going to try to cast some spells. Um, oh, okay. So <laughs> I'll just yeah, she's... I'll roll a 50%. So if it's a one through five, the, if the 10 sided dice is one through five, it misses. So six through 10, it makes it. Okay. So here's our first bolt coming at you when it misses it yeah, anyway. And then the second bolt. Which misses you, because she can't get it. She can't muster the... Blows in her hand. <laughs> yeah, and she starts screaming something, and then she's going to move. <laughs> I'm just no laughing at her. Understand it. Down there. <laughs> um, I just start laughing. <laughs> <laughs> like Jabba. Oh, oh, oh. Jabba do waka. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can't get her down these stairs. Uh-oh. She's trying to go down the stairs, but I can't move my camera to get her down the stairs. How do I can't do that. She's too can't, mad. Can't do stairs when your tongue's bleeding. It's, it's impossible. <laughs> I just lost her. She's a fun time. Uh, I don't know how to get her down there. Oh, oh there her. you go. <laughs> She's like dancing around <laughs> the door. <laughs> you gotta drop her right down the hole. Uh, All the way to the bottom. Dang. So she climbs. Don't look in there. Uh-oh. I was about to. It just chopped it, chopped it in half straight away. Jeez. So she climbs down. Um, that is her turn. Saren, you're up. I'm going to move. Up to here. And I can see that guy over there, and I'm going to cast a second level guiding bolt at him. Okay. Which guy? The guy on the balcony up there. The top guy or the lower guy? The lower guy. Okay. That's a hit. Oh, yeah. Take... 22 radiant damage. Hey, nice. he gets blasted. First time he's been hit. Boom. He's grabbing his shoulder and he's not looking good. So him and the guy on top, they're both looking real bad. And I'm going to take a step back. So he can't shoot. Eru, you're up. I am going to <clears throat> run over here. Run through that little hole again. There's Fifteen feet of movement. Uh, I can see this guy from here. Mm-hmm. Uh, I will fire my crossbow at him. He has. He just got hit with a guiding bolt, so I have advantage. Natural twenty. Okay, you line the shot up. Steady shot. Thunk. Boom. Right through the head. And he drops. If you want to roll the dice, you go right ahead. I don't want to take it away from you. But. <laughs> You're going to do more damage than what he's going to be able to handle. Uh, <laughs> it goes through his head into a brick. The brick goes flying out the other side oh as you my. <laughs> blast this guy. Dang. Wow. <laughs> How much damage did you do? Movement. 35. <laughs> uh, as you step by this doorway, you can see this room is just filled with spider webs. Oh, great. And I will <laughs> bonus action hide uh, right behind that wall there. It's all like... It's... it's um. It's all in shambles. You can't really make out anything in there. It's just thick with spider webs. 30 stealth. Sunny cheeks. Between this post in the wall. I'm going to crawl. I got to move myself away from the wall so I can go up. I'm going to crawl to this edge. So that I can hopefully see that guy on the ledge up there that I know is there. Yeah, you got enough of him for what you want to do. Sweet. Blast. In fact, he's kind of like leaning over the edge anyway, so you got a, you got a sight from pretty much anywhere down there. Kill him quick, Krog just got there. 
<laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I was like, yes. Cross, like jumping over people and climbing, scaling flat walls to get to hit someone. And every time Literally. he shows up, they die in front of them. <laughs> or run away at this point. <laughs> Man. Holy crap. Uh, well, anyways, make me that deck Nope. Oh man. Croc's like cracking his knuckles, getting ready I know. to punch. I'm, I'm like <laughs> lightning bolt. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty seven oh, damage. Oh, man. I was so ready. <laughs> okay, you done you don't even know where it came from. You don't even know where I am. Like, like I'm like, what's going on? Croc, <laughs> on? You it's think it, that might have been from you? Oh Just yeah. The way you charged in there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling pretty. I am pretty strong. Strong. <laughs> strong. Yeah, literally. Crowd, right. gear up. Okay, so I saw her run into that to those stairs. Yeah, she went to that that hatch there. I'm gonna approach it and look oh, inside. Like... Face hey. palm wipes his face. You off. see her? She's still on the ladder, climbing down. Uh, and further down you can see there is a at the, at the bottom of that ladder there's a very large spider down there she's heading towards the spider yeah <laughs> the whole room is just thick jump, with spider jump. webs just and there's a lot of down. like things that are wrapped up in web and punch uh, the ladder <laughs> <laughs> so she's going straight down yeah climbing down, or, the, down or the ladder down the ladder okay uh, -huh. uh i'll i'll uh I'll pursue at a distance and try and like catch up to her, so I can try and go for a grab. Okay. Wee. Um, you should, you should just drop down and try to grab can, her on the way. You can make it to her because <laughs> you think you, you can make can? it to her. Yeah. Okay. I would, let me. I want to try and like reach down and grab her from from going down any further. Krog doesn't like spiders. You come back up here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to go over here with that spider. Legs and then climb back up with only your arms. <laughs> oh, gosh. Can I do that? Ah, uh, one second, one second. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Anything is possible. Anything. Except for a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> you just got to be persuasive enough. Okay, no, tell me what, you, what you're doing. Sorry. I want to grab her. Okay. Before she goes any further down. Okay, yeah. Climb on down. Give me an opposed... Athletics versus her. Where's she at? Um, she was heavier though, so she's gonna roll dice. Oh, look at that! Athletics. Wow. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Silvery bars. No. <laughs> yeah. Dang. Oh. Well. Oh. Uh, I got a one. I got a twenty-two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you go down and she's squirming around. You can see she like it's she's hard to grab because she's got blood all over her. As her face uh -huh. has an arrow hole in it. But you man you just managed to get a hold of her. Okay. Okay. On the stairs, you're about ten feet above this giant spider. Ten feet above the giant spider? Mm -hmm. And you uh, think that you're thinking that's a big spider. That's bigger oh than me. Lord. Okay. Can I uh since I have a also, hold of her, it's it's yeah. There is a she has a very large abdomen and there's a lot of something on that abdomen. I don't I don't want to hear about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to make it as as arachnophobic friendly as possible. It's just something on the uh on the butt. <laughs> <laughs> Got something on the butt. <laughs> what what on the butt? <laughs> oh. <clears throat> okay. Okay, you got her. I got her. All right. So is that all I can do, or can I? Can I? Uh, that was what an action. A grapple is one attack. Yeah. So you one. can still do. So I can still do. So it. You yep. can Two like attacks, then you can punch her. You can try to yank her off and just uh, use her as, um, you know, what, what's the word? <laughs> to let her fall onto the spider. <laughs> you, well, well I don't quite, know why you wouldn't quite be on the spider. I guess you could. You could throw her on the spider. You could just body slam her on the ground and. Oh man, I guess I could do a bunch of things. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep the grab for now. Just throw her. Uh, I can just throw her. Sure. Sure, I'll do that. I'll throw her. Where you want to throw her? I want to throw her uh, at the spider. Yeah. Okay. Roll me. Um, 
Just make me a ranged attack. A ranged attack. So a d20 plus, plus your just dex. my my dex. Okay. Mm -hmm. So d20. I'm letting it slide for the sake of interesting. Oh no! <laughs> oh. Seven. oh no! <laughs> Okay, so you go to throw her, but she's just so slippery. Okay. And she doesn't quite land on the spider. And you can okay. see, as you're, like, getting ready, she, she knows what you're trying to do. And, and she starts really squirming and, and hampering you from letting her fall onto the spider. And she okay. slams onto the ground below you. Okay. Um, and it hurts. Taking three damage. <laughs> with, with the spider? She's right behind the spider now. Oh, okay. I'll stay. I, I guess I'll, I'll stay there at the ladder close to the top or where i was at okay and i'll st yeah i'll just stay there zurik my turn all right kind of want to jump up to here but at the same time i also just want to go through but the spider is on the bottom floor isn't he you don't know anything about a spider <laughs> all right cool uh I'm you're just too concerned about that hole in the chest take that point of damage. <laughs> uh <laughs> Grab some of that webbing and pack it in there. Just one finger, <laughs> right in the hole. He walks around like that. Uh, do I know about spider webs in there? Um, you can probably see them from where webs? you're at. You can see a few of them kind of begin out of the door. All right, cool. Can I just make a fire and just burn down the thing? Uh, um, yes, but the, like only the the spot that where the webbing is catches fire. That's cool. I'll do that. We had this big um discussion at other D D a long time ago were you there when we, were you playing there when we did it we talked about this i think so yeah and yeah so i the burning all the webs yeah so i went i had a chicken coop in the backyard and there was a big web on it so i was like i'm gonna try i'm gonna do i'm gonna see how this works and so i got a lighter and i lit it and only that little section burned it didn't like woof you know yeah, it's just it's not a fuse <laughs> that's how we always played it in D D. you light one of them and the whole thing goes yeah, the whole thing goes. <laughs> it seems not good for like nature. Like when there's a bunch of spider webs. It seems like a, a terrible other. idea for nature. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but yeah, yes. since the spider well, is evolved. It, so it if you incredibly flammable it. webs, if you, you would just the area that you light will go, like that five foot area would would go. They okay. kind of melt instead of burn. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Do we have any like bombs? They don't have a bomber expert no more. That's what we need. We need him back. Uh, I'm going to jump. I'm going to see if I can jump up to here. Nuke it from orbit. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way to be sure. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can try and jump up to here. It's what, 20 feet? How far can I jump? <laughs> oh, no. Now everybody wants uh, to jump. <laughs> everybody's jumping. <laughs> uh, 13. You cannot. I go here. What's your strength score? My strength is maxed out, I think. No, what is your score? 20, yeah. Oh, Plus 20. 5. So you can yeah, jump 20. 8. It's 13 feet up. So you have another 6 feet to go. Um, I don't think you're going to make it. So well, if I, I, jump, so I, if I even... 14. Plus, so if I get up on this ledge... You're, what, 3 even? feet tall? Your arms are probably another 1 and a half. <laughs> I don't think you're going to make it. Yeah. What if I went up on, like, an elevated area? Then could I make it? Parkour. Well, there's always a chance. You can roll that acrobatics check. Yeah, it's... Right, athletics. Athletics. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go right here and I'm gonna jump up. You might be able to do it. Mm -hmm. Here's, yeah, here's what's so, acrobatics. Um, we'll say a 15. It's a good, nice round number. Um, athlete, athletics. Athletics. I guess acro better. either one, whichever one works. No, athletics. Okay. Um, you're, you're gonna grab. You're, the only chance is grabbing, <laughs> grabbing the edge and hoisting yourself up. Okay. So that's if you make it, that works. If you miss it, you're gonna fall and take the d6 damage for the. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> <laughs> that wound right. is about to get. He does bigger. the thing where he grabs it and he just swings up and his body hits the bottom. Oh and falls no! <laughs> okay, I'll just use this one. So you go up to grab it, not even close. Like it, <laughs> you weren't even anywhere near <laughs> the ledge. This is the ledge. You just, <laughs> you just <laughs> slam down, and as you as you slam to the oh, ground, no. your helmet <laughs> smashes down onto your oh. head. And Ow. <laughs> um, you, so you are blinded because your helmet is smushed oh, into no. your face. It's going to take you uh, a bonus action to fix your helmet. 
Yeah, Next turn, right. I know what your action uh, and bonus action should be. <laughs> so he's bleeding and he's. Oh, he can't see. He's yeah. got this helmet he's, smashed he's, over he's, his eyes. <laughs> I can't just do that right now, can't I? This is, uh... Oh, no. I'll just, uh, yeah. I'll just fix that right now. Okay. Yeah, and I think I saw. Do I saw movement left, or is that my whole thing? Uh, no, that's your thing. <laughs> okay. It's like, where are they? Let me add them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, you done? Poor sir. Yeah. My turn. I was hoping to make it. It would have been so cinematically cool and everything. Okay, so it was. It was cool. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. So you're thinking something like a, like a Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves kind of kind of thing. You got men in tights. <laughs> your skills there. She's gonna step away from the spider and turn around, and she sees a crog on the ladder. And she's going to two bolts are gonna come out of her uh, hand, hopefully. Bolt number one is not going to come out because she just can't, she's <laughs> blood just sputtering out of her mouth. <laughs> Second one, blood is just sputtering. She just <laughs> cannot. She cannot get the spell out. That's horrible. Um, that's all I got. That's all I got. You see, up, Saren. I am going to. Start the spider. Doing? Why is it doing the Spider <laughs> Krog is yeah, just. I'm just sitting there. It's not doing anything. It's just, it's just sitting, sitting there. there. It's kind of scratching over every once in a while, and it's kind of you see the hairs like shaking a little bit, twitching. Yeah. Um, you see a little bit of movement on its abdomen. Stop it! But <laughs> 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 Saren, you're up. Okay. I'm gonna move to here. In and in this place, hold... Krog. Uh -huh. Um. There's a bunch of, like, webbed up things. So it's hard to really make out what's in this room. Um, but you do spot in the corner, over here in this corner, um, behind this web here. Um, there is, there is a, there's like a, there's something webbed, there's a body, poorly, or partially webbed up. There's an arm laying out that's still not quite webbed up. It looks fresh. Yeah, I was gonna ask that. Okay. Not, not moving fresh, but yeah, yeah. I'll go inside. I'll double move and get in. Okay. And again, you're once you're in here, it's double, you know half movement because of the webbing. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's least favorite feature of D and D five E: difficult terrain. As you come in here, um, it's this. If anything is organized, it's going to be this bottom area, and it's organized in there's just sort of a pile of weapons. There's a pile of bags still webbing all over it. Um, there's a chest that's pile of boxes kind of thing webbed over, but it's sort of like stashed in their spots. There's some long swords, daggers, a couple bows. You see laying there. Long swords now you say. <laughs> uh, yeah, the um, the fellow outside. <laughs> you walked by a fellow with a long sword. Oh really? Yeah. <clears throat> Are you done, Joe? <laughs> yeah. Okay, everybody, you're up. Oh, boy. I don't like... Where are you? Is. Okay, here I go. You going in? <clears throat> I am going to a bonus action dash. Running here. Uh, uh, I can't... Yeah, I can't see. Uh, I cannot see it. There we go. Oh gosh. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. The webs. <laughs> That's the webs. That's what it is. No webs. Good role playing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Uh, okay. There's. Uh, 30 ish. 40 ish. 55. Is that where the spider is? Oh, boy. <laughs> I, was what I, mean, I mean, does he just turn and see a spider? <laughs> uh, uh -oh. oh, hi. Everybody's going to have nightmares tonight. Oh, man. This uh, is a big, big spider. I... Oh boy! Oh man! 
You feel you can you could nimbly walk by this guy. And there is some even some evidence of someone has recently walked by here. Um But yeah, he's right there. Oh, cool. Um, so that was about fifty feet of movement. I, say he. I am going to She's right there. Uh-huh. Use my action to dash. Run away. <laughs> <laughs> There's 60. Second. 60. She did not attack, but she does watch you very carefully as you go back down the stairs. And she's got something. Since you're out there by her mouth, she's got something in her mouth. Oh. Hey, what you got in your mouth? What you got? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All right, Tony. Uh, Are you done? I'm going to jump down to this table, I guess. Okay. I'll just say this. Man, big. <laughs> Big spider up there. <laughs> Sunny cheeks. All right. Uh, I'm going to go up. I'm going to try to go up. Let me go up. There we go. I think as a spider, you can walk on webbing without any hindrance. Uh, yeah, I can. And do you have the thing where you know where everything is? Oh, I don't know. Web the sense. Web sense. Yeah. Do you get that? I'll look it up. If so, you sense there are some things on the next floor. <laughs> <laughs> That's as far as I can move, so I, I can. I'm gonna double move. I'll double move up to here. And stop. I mean, it's. I hear there's a party on that abdomen that you might be invited to. <laughs> Go down there and hang out. This is my new family. <laughs> uh, yeah, web sense and web walker and spider climb. Yeah. Web sense, Monica. Yeah. Yep. Something big upstairs and a couple other things up there. Two big things. Crog's pretty big. Okay, Krog, you're up. All right, I'm going to... I'm going to... So I'm still on the ladder. So I'm going to jump down. And I'm going to try and grapple her. To, to jump down is going gonna, is gonna to be a D10 of damage. Oh, it's that far up? Okay, He's so... a monk. Oh, you are a monk. Don't you have slow fall? Uh, yeah, actually, I do. Reduce any falling damage you take by 45. By 45? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Five times your monk level, so yeah, 45. <laughs> so I will fall to the floor. Okay. Uh, and then I will attempt to grapple her. Just land on top of her. I mean, if I can land on top of her, that um, she's a little too far away from. I, mean, I guess you oh, can. Okay. You, yeah, you, you know what? You could just since you're so far up there, you can jump off jump. and get her. Yeah, I will do that then. I wasn't sure if that was possible. I um, will do that. You will know, just do it with the opposed, um, the opposed grapple. Oh. So is it athletics or acrobatics? Athletics. Oh, athletics for you. I think you got it, boss. I hope so. <laughs> Twenty. Yeah, you yeah, just yeah. land. Oh, and she squeaks. Oh, at least you land right on top of her. Okay. She I goes will, prone as you hit her. Like that's my, yeah, yeah, that'll be my one. She's, she goes prone. Yeah, blood's <laughs> sparks everywhere. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, I want to... I Obviously, I see the spider. I think, right? I, I'm aware that there's yeah. a big spider. In <laughs> <laughs> nope, I completely missed it. <laughs> Is it looking at me? Uh, No. It's, it's, it's looking at something else. Something else got its, got its attention. Better not be me. <laughs> <laughs> I will. I will approach the spider with you're gonna, her. You're it, jump. It, She's not dead. She just knocked her prone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna like. I wanna drag her towards that direction, but I don't know if I can after everything I did. Oh uh, yeah, it's half movement. You can drag her. I want. Okay, then I'll do that. I'll drag her. Quarter to... movement, right? Because of all the webs. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, if that's the case, then. I'll go there. Pick her up and throw her like a football. But I'll keep her in front of me in case that spider reacts. Yeah. Okay. And then that's it. <laughs> and then punch her in the face while I'm looking at the spider. <laughs> okay, Zarek, you're up. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I am going to... Um, first, I'm going to heal my, uh, my, my, my bleeding. Oh, so I'm going nice. to stop that. I'm actually for that. I'm not coming here. Oh, you're, you're finally stopping your bleeding? 
Yeah. Okay. I know. You step in, and you've got to stop it after five turns. You auto die. (laughs) You got a a heavily webbed ruin and storage room. Oh boy, what all weapons do I see? That's what I can read. First glance, you got a couple long swords. There's a pile of four daggers there. Um, you see a shield, kind of a a rough looking shield. Um, there's a box which looks like there is. Um, well, you can't tell. It's a box is closed. It's webbing over it, and um. Oh, what was the other thing I said? Um, I forget what it was. Bows. Is there no oh, spears? Bows. Couple bows. No, no Couple spears. Couple bows. No spears. Okay. Nope. I don't need a spear. That's fine. I will... Where should I move? Maybe you're half moving in here because of the webs. I think I should be right here then. Uh... What can I do? Can't really do much. What can I do as a point section? That will be my turn. Okay. My um my shaman is giving up on spellcasting. <laughs> <laughs> she coughs a bit more. Nice move. Um <clears throat> I have her hit points down wrong, so I don't remember. You hit her for... Uh, I don't even remember. Has she only been hit the one time with the with the arrow with, when you threw it back at her? With the arrow? Yeah, I, th- I think so. Unless that is she it. was hit before that. Okay. So she's bleeding all over, I but really... He punched her, I thought he punched her once after that. Yeah, I thought he hit her really hard. Mm. I don't think he did, because... I, I don't think I did. She went down the stairs, and he went down and grabbed her. Yeah. Yeah. Not a lot of damage has been done. Yeah. Other yeah, than the face. Um... Oh, he she fell. Because he, he tossed her off the ladder. Oh, yeah, she That's did take was. that damage, yeah. How did, get, how did that get off? Hmm. So she took three points of fall damage plus the... the... Oh, okay, I know, I know what happened. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> um, also, I haven't taken my bleed damage. Okay, so she's bleeding. Um, she is going to just, with these nasty claws, um, she's going to grab onto you and just start scratching. Crog. Okay. She's going to do this twice. With a... Oh, those are bad. 12 and a 13. No. What are you doing? (laughs) This is embarrassing. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, she's done. Okay. Spider does not move. It it um, it like shifts its weight and kind of looks over at you two, but it does not do anything else. I think the spider is high. (laughs) Yeah, probably. (laughs) Saren, you're up. It's like just super chill. And you can see in the spider's in the spider's mouth there is a hand. An arm. Oh. An arm. Oh. It, it's not gnawing on. Oh, my. Mm. Thought this might be a quick fight until I, until difficult terrain came in. <laughs> <laughs> it took us five turns to get there. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I got you. <laughs> That's what happened to me. <laughs> it's like, oh no. Oh. I, I think I can. I'll double move and get up to here. Nice. Okay. Like, oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, my. Spider turns and looks at you as it's not on its. I told you it was up there. It's like mouth is right there. I'm just going to be like, you are the foulest looking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> That's not very nice. Arrow, <laughs> yeah. you're up. Uh, well, okay. Um, I will pop off of this. I was supposed to have disadvantage on my Bonus melee attacks, aren't I? Anyway, because I was grappled. Right from her? Uh, no, that's why I restrained. Oh, okay. 
Uh, bonus action dash. Five. Twenty. And I will daintily walk around that spider as <laughs> it doesn't seem to be doing anything. And booming blade the shaman. <laughs> and she's prone, right? Read the description of that booming blade again. That's loud, right? Yeah. Okay. Wait, wait a minute. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's too late. <laughs> Give me a nature check. Your face is sealed. Oh. Ugh, those are pretty awful. Ooh, those are pretty awful, but she's on the ground and... Yeah, you got her. That's uh, 9 plus a 16. That's a hit. Uh, 31 points of damage. That was a good roll. Wow. Okay. You stab her. This boom goes off. She, eyes close. Um, the boom. The spider's like. Ju- the spider, <laughs> the spider jumps. And in its. Oh, oh Awakening. Oh. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. <laughs> Explanation point. It takes its ready to action on the first thing that it sees. My head. Which is, yeah. <laughs> Saren's <laughs> head. So he, With the arm in its mouth? She goes oh. in. Arm falls out. Goes to oh. bite. Oh, no. Oh. This, this is our fun hour. Oh, boy. That's <laughs> ready. With an 11. That's amazing. Goes and chomps. Oh, and man. that's where we'll end. Okay. <laughs> nice. I'm gonna step behind Croc. <laughs> the rest of my movement. Oh, <laughs> Alright, we'll start. I'll write this down. We'll start with Sunny Cheeks. And Angry Mama Spider. That was something. Um, I wonder oh if boy. we're fighting the spider. Answer oh, thanks yeah. to thanks to Eris Genius Attack, yeah. <laughs> There was no getting around this. The spider has to die. <laughs> I wasn't sure what was going to happen there. We could have had a friend. Maybe a it's pet. a friendly spider. Yeah, friendly spider doctor. eating an arm. <laughs> it's <laughs> very friendly. Trying to just bite my head off. <laughs> <laughs> because it got startled. All right. Thanks for watching. Like all those people. Bye. 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 Yeah. We didn't fire the first shot, okay, Eric? That's right.